for me, okay, so I work at a, at, for those of you who don't, I didn't really say what Creative Artists Agency does, but we're a talent agency. For those, for those of you who are unfamiliar, we to summarize it, we find our clients' work. Um, we specialize in, uh, traditionally in the entertainment type of clients, you know, the motion picture and television stars, but also increasingly in uh, all kinds of things like speakers, and uh, we're becoming the largest sports agency in the world, that kind of thing, and we're moving internationally. And I think, for me, the biggest thing uh, that I've noticed is, the biggest challenge I have is, bringing IT solutions to bear that fit in the culture, that work in the culture. So like you were talking about data earlier. Data, figuring out what cool things to do with data is easy for a technology person. We, in fact, I'll give you just one concrete example. Um, I recently, I was talking, we were one of the largest uh, music touring uh, booking agencies that we, we, a lot of the, the you know, we're, we're the Katy Perry tour and things like that, that's all us. And so what happens is that um, I was talking to the music agents and I was talking about tour routing and I was saying, oh, you know, it's really interesting. When you're building out the tours, we could do uh, some sentiment analysis on the various locations, see where the fans are, see, you know, that kind of stuff. And, uh, you know, and some of the agents, you know, are really into it, they're cool about it. And a couple of them are like, ah, I just need a map and a phone, right? <laughs> and that kind of thing. And it's, I realize, you know, I have to bring it in carefully and I have to do it right. And that's the biggest challenge for me, is not getting ahead of myself and sort of pushing the solutions in before I figure out how it fits into the real culture of how we do business. Yes, yeah, I'll jump in. Actually, at, at Disney, um, uh, we have a little bit of money, so, um, <laughs> which is great. Um, and actually, it's really exciting, certainly in the economic times that we've had over the last couple of years. Actually, for me, it's, it's prioritization. We have so many people that want to do so much cool stuff in the interactive media space. How do you decide which one you get to do? And, and you know, you got to kind of um, get people to stop and quantify and spend time really talking about the business value. And, and doing that without inhibiting innovation is a really interesting challenge for us. So I think that's a, a little bit of a rare one right now for a lot of folks, but it's really exciting. But the last thing I want to do is take that precious commodity of money, you know, that precious, precious value of money and, and spend it on something that's not going to deliver exceptional value. Right? And so I think everybody's in that same spot. We just happen to be in a place where we've got a million different ideas and a million different opportunities to do that. It, it, just to touch, uh, they talked about the, the consumerization of, 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 of IT or the retailization of it, and, and that's a huge challenge for us. In this. Um, the, on the one hand, you know, a lot of our stuff has been developed in the context of, of traditional corporate IT. Um, but obviously, as we move closer and closer and closer to the consumer, um, a lot of those uh, expectations and systems and uh, you know, there are enormous changes, uh, particularly when it comes to collecting people's information. Um, and that's been one of the, the, the biggest challenges. So you wanna... I was gonna say one more thing, okay. I'm sorry, but I know one here's gonna say it, but it's a ta talent, attacking talent. Yeah. Right oh, now yeah. there is a talent war going on, in case you weren't paying attention. Yeah. Facebook said they're gonna hire 6,000 people this year. You've got um, you, you've got uh, Amazon, you've got uh, Google, you've got all these folks that are that are or that was Google at the time, just thousand people this year, sorry. And Facebook's probably higher twice that many, just you know, first bite. Um, so <laughs> as, as we're all looking around and trying to figure figure out um, how do you attract the best talent, how do you retain the best talent? So I mean, I think that that is in and of itself something that I'm sure we all spend time with every day, trying to make sure that we've got a really great team working on interesting and exciting things.